Hello all, I am Tanvi and I welcome you all to my channel. I am again back with uh, another review video. Today's review video is about a moisturizing cream from the well-known brand Tony Moly. It is called Cat Bling Cream from uh, their Cat Bling range. And uh, I have used it now for almost two months. So I'm whatever the review I will be giving that is based upon my usage that I have used it for two months. So now let us start with the video. Before getting into the video, I would like to request you all, those who have not subscribed to my channel yet, please do subscribe to my channel, especially those who have come for the first time on my channel. And please keep on liking and sharing my videos as I need your support and motivation. So before uh, getting into the video, I would like to give you a short disclaimer that I am not a medical practitioner or a doctor. So whatever the views I will be presenting, it is based upon my personal experience, uh, it is not a medical advice, so make your decision wisely. Before I start with the product review, I would like to tell you one thing more as I have uh, said in my previous videos as well that we all are born with a different skin type. And uh, some people have oily skin, some have dry skin, like I have a combination kind of a skin. So always choose the products uh, that are ideal for your skin type. Like if you have dry skin, then look for the products that are rich in emollients and humectants that can keep your skin moisturized for the rest of the day. And the people who are uh, who have oily skin, they must look for the products that keep your skin uh, like free from the acne or they should be non comedogenic so you must uh, you know look at the list of the ingredients uh, before buying the product so now let's get back to the product review i'm always on a lookout for the products that could keep my skin nourished and moisturized for the whole day and at the same time it could heal the skin also as i have already told in my previous videos if you are following me that i have a combination kind of a skin and at the same time i have a damaged skin barrier so i always look for the products that are rich in emollients humectants and fatty acids that could you know uh, uh, keep my protective uh, barrier intact but of course uh, it takes time nothing is uh, going to change my skin overnight i know that but uh, you get to know in one or two weeks when you start using the product that whether the product is working or not so same i will be telling you regarding this cream that whether it has helped me or not so stay with me till the end as I will be giving you a detailed review about this product so you can make your decision about this cream whether you want to buy it or not. So now again let's get back to the review. So let's talk about the packaging first. This cream, Cadbling cream comes in a jar like this and uh, it's quite sturdy. It is made up of a good quality plastic and kind of a high-end packaging color is uh, off-white something of this jar and it has a cute cap uh, it has a cute cat attached to the cap of this jar and this is the cutest part of this jar so when you open it you find the product like this kind of a gel uh, of milky texture uh, it's not very clear due to the light the jar is of course is of good quality but the only drawback is that you always need to put your fingers in the jar in the product as it has no spatula or it doesn't come in a bottle uh, having pump or nozzle so yes you have to dip your fingers in the product every time you want to apply it so if you have any issue you can use a spatula and those who have no issues they can apply with clean fingers and yes uh, avoid sharing with the other people as then there are likely chances that you can have infections because I generally don't like uh, so many people using my products so this is about the packaging so let's talk about the price uh, I got it for 1150 rupees you can get it at a dis discount and uh, I got it from Nika and it's available on different e-commerce websites. I'll be sharing you a few links with you. And uh, my purchase was totally unintentional. I was just scrolling through the products of Tony Moly on Nika and I came across this cream and I went, uh, I went through the ingredients list and it was quite impressive. So that's why 
I made my decision and uh, this product will last for 4-5 months so if you are paying like 1000 or something for this cream then and it's working also then I think it's fine. So now let me show you the consistency of this product like Etude House Sonjan Emulsion. This is also not a proper cream or lotion. It is somewhere in between but not exactly gel. It has a kind of uh, gel and uh, cream kind of a uh, consistency somewhere in between and uh, when you apply it, uh, it will get easily absorbed. A very light in weight the best part of this is you will not feel like you have applied something it's very lightweight and uh, very transparent so when you apply it uh, you will feel like you have applied some gloss over your face but after some time it gets truly absorbed and yes one thing is there that it has a kind of a citrusy uh, fragrance like kind of a orange Maybe because it has uh, orange peel oil in this. So if you are someone who is very sensitive to fragrance, I think you may not be liking it for the first uh, half an hour. But yes, after some time the fragrance gets completely subsided. So now let's move on to the ingredients. So the ingredient list is quite quite impressive as we all know that most of the Korean products are made up of naturally derived ingredients that is the best part of uh, these brands. They use naturally derived ingredients and these days we all uh, want uh, you know our products to be loaded less with the chemical. So let me tell you about some of uh, its ingredients. Uh, its ingredients list is quite impressive. It is made up of uh, emollients, hamactans and uh, uh, what you call that antioxidants. So it has a combination of uh, all these things and for a healthy skin we require all these things in our product. So it has caprylic uh, triglyceride that helps to keep our skin nourished and creates a barrier over our skin then it has extracts uh, different extracts from uh, different ingredients like it has milk protein extract, lettuce extract, peppermint extract, pea extract and all these extracts uh, work as antioxidants these have antibacterial properties and at the same time they provide hydration to your skin then there are different oils as well like safflower oil, primrose oil these oils also provide hydration to your skin and primrose oil as we all know improves the overall health of your skin. So I can say that uh, there are many ingredients in this product that are going to help with your skin issues a lot. So if you are someone with oily skin, dry skin, normal skin or even a sensitive skin, I think this cream is not going to cause any allergy because I have a sensitive skin and uh, till date I have not faced any issue. Uh, yes, there is a kind of a citrusy smell uh, fragrance that I have already told you but I am not that much sensitive to the fragrance. If the product is working fine then I can tolerate that. So now I will be telling you about uh, the effect that I have got on my skin after using this product. I apply it uh, on daily basis in the morning and I can like apply it in the evening also after washing my face there is no as such uh, times uh, prescribed for you know using this cream it is it totally depends upon you because it's completely safe it is mostly made up of natural ingredients so it is usually safe and uh, I have been using for two months almost but uh, yes after for using for two months it has become a regular moisturizer for me I was using Evin and Bioderma earlier I'm still using them but I use them generally at night and I use this as my day moisturizer and it keeps your skin very supple very soft for the rest of the day you do not need to apply this moisturizer again but you can keep it in your bag on safer side so this was my review about the product now you have to take your decision as I've told you, dry skin, normal skin, sensitive skin people can easily use it but still if you have any allergy with the, any of the ingredients, you can go through uh, the ingredients list. list, it's quite available on the internet. If you think that some, is, some of them is going to cause you an allergy, then you can skip this product, otherwise it's a very very good moisturizer that you can use on daily basis. And 
coming to the end of this video i would like to request you all so if you have still not subscribed to my channel not liked my videos not sharing them then please do the needful it would be a really really great thing if you will be doing that and i would be highly highly thankful to you for that so keep on sharing liking and do subscribe to my channel so i will be meeting you soon with another informative video please do let me know in the comment section if you want me to make a review upon any product because uh, i like uh, experimenting with the new products i will be meeting you soon with my another informative video till then take care goodbye